Most of the drawings we've already looked at in this section are classed as typical AutoCAD electrical schematic drawings. That's because they're schematics containing schematic symbols and wiring for our AutoCAD electrical project. You'll notice as well in the Demo 05 project in the Project Manager, if I just minimize that subfolder, we've got there a schematic subfolder and a panel subfolder. We'll look at panel drawings in a moment. Let's look at schematics first. So if I just click on the plus sign there, we've got Demo 03 open in the Project Demo 05 in the Project Manager. Now a schematic drawing, a typical schematic drawing, if I zoom in, has these schematic components and wiring linking the components. So as you can see, if I zoom in on these fuses here, for example, there's my wires, 305, 305A, and there's my fuses there, FU307, FU307A, and the location there is MCAB5, MCAB5. So you can see there that these are typical schematic drawings. Now, the reason that they're schematic drawings is they contain schematic components. So as soon as you start inserting these components using the schematic tab on the ribbon here and the icon menu where you go into the actual icon menu and pick the icons that you want to represent, things like push buttons, fuses and circuit breakers, you're automatically creating, in essence, a schematic drawing. You can see here I'm using JIC schematic symbols. So schematic symbols go into a typical schematic drawing in AutoCAD Electrical. So I'll just cancel the icon menu there. And what you do as well in your project is you organize schematic drawings all to be in a subfolder and also panel drawings to be in a subfolder, plus any other typical drawing types that you may need. So what I'll do here now is I'll just double click on the wheel, make sure I zoom to extents there. And what you do, just as a good CAD practice in AutoCAD Electrical, is you make sure that you zoom extents like that and just save your drawing so that when someone goes into this drawing next time round, they can see everything rather than being zoomed in on a component like that. You don't know what that is, where it is, what it's doing. So what you do is just double click on the wheel, zoom extents, and then save the drawing. So that's your typical schematic drawing in AutoCAD Electrical.